So what brings you today, love man? Um, to play golf and to have a few days holiday. Yep, got fantastic scenery and... Uh, Beautiful weather. And actually really nice welcoming people in the golf clubs. Have you played golf here before? We have. We have, yes. We came last year. We came and last year. Everybody's very friendly. Yep. Yes. What's been your favourite course so far? That's a very good question because they're all very different. Yeah. They go from parklands and glens to, well, this one is, I think is going to be a bit hilly, so... It's millionaire's golf. Actually, it's billionaire's golf, quite frankly. And you wonder where the hell everybody is. I mean, it's just when you go to courses sometimes and you have to queue up on the tees. Here, you know, it's just, as I say, billionaire's golf. <laughs> Rick, how was the podcast this morning? That was awesome. I, I enjoyed was, it. Have you been on many podcasts before? First one. Really? Yeah, I was a podcast virgin. You're pretty good. I broke my cherry. You're pretty good. You're you're thoughtful, eloquent, but also you don't run on too long. That's the biggest problem. Well, yeah. When people just like literally go on like a 12 minute story about like a pile of sand in Nebraska. <laughs> no, it was good. I think we could. I think we could have gone on if we didn't have a bit of a time limit, but Easily. it's sunny Easily. and we want to get on the golf course. Do you know what uh, Tiger Woods and I have in common? Both allergic to grass. Not crazy. Allergic to grass. <laughs> Sad world. And so do you know where we're headed right now? I do not. We're almost there. Right? We're literally two minutes from the hotel. That's the great thing about Isle of Man is everything is very close. Nice. All right, so here we are at our second golf experience on Isle of Man. Um, Jed, tell me the name of this course again. King Edward Bay. King it's Edward formerly Bay. called House Drake. House Drake. Yeah, it's been I prefer that name. developed from uh, nine holes to 18 holes. So okay. It's got a lot of individuality. Okay. Bit of a Marmite job. Do you know about Marmite? Uh, the you stuff you put on toast that I don't like? Or you hate it. Yeah. Ah, okay. I, ha I, love I it. hate Marmite. I hate it. Hate it. But house, house gate? House Creek? House Drake. House Drake? House Drake. Like Drake the rapper. Right, Drake the Strake. rapper. No? Like straight. House Drake. House. I've never heard that word. Strake. House Strake. Strake is it? What does the strake mean? We'll have to look it up, won't we? <laughs> was, that means you doesn't know. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, we'll call it King Edward Bay. Oh, <laughs> Let's just run through the. Should we, we play like the course as fast as we can? No one's out there. No. Oh, How fast do you think we can play it? <laughs> Let's time it. What time is your flight? Oh, late. Late. We've got Six time. or five. Yeah, we got time to play. 18 holes, how fast can we play? Jed, what do you think? Go for it. How, how fast can we play 18 holes? <laughs> Just go for it. No two watch. and a half hours. He says two and a half hours. I think we can beat that. I'm going to go 220. Let's see who wins. All right, we're going to play speed. Go this is going to be good. About the score. Do you think old Tom would be proud of us or rolling in his grave? Well, I think now we're taking golf carts. I think he'll be over the over the moon. He'll have a smile on his face. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Jed. I'm pumped. Time to beat you. All right, but this is real. I'm not kidding. We're really gonna do speed golf. I'm not, it's not gonna be some editing shit. We're really gonna do it. You guys okay? Can you handle it? You can handle it. Later, Jed. All right, here we go. All right, so it's, what do you got, 10.50? 10.50 on the nose. All right, go. This is speed golf, Isle of Man. Ooh, spanked it. Wait, should we just play best ball? No, play your own ball. <laughs> <laughs> like, no. I like how he says that after I just as you snap it. On down the first. Yeah. Here we are. Welcome to the golf show. Rick Shields in the passenger seat, and we're playing speed golf. 10:50 we teed off. 12:50 is the target. 12:50 we're going to try to be done by. What is this place? It's just a field. Yeah. Yep. That'll work. Let's go. Yeah. In the interest of time, I'm just gonna let you go. I'm gonna hit my shot. Jason. Yeah. I had to draw it. Use the contour of the slope. Yeah. Yeah. Load it. Birdie opportunity on the first hole. Not yeah. the fastest start. We're gonna have to pick up pace if we want to try and break two hours. We can't find it. Right there. Right in line with us. Yeah. Good eyes. This is the most yeah. slanted yeah. fairway I've ever been on in my life. Yeah. Thanks. Took an awful bounce. Back left to the green. Got a chance at a par. You bring my putter. Gotcha. Yeah. 
Good par. Oh, man, I have to settle for double. Yeah. 10 minutes, that, that hole took ages. But we were getting our groove. Now we got the run in and we got some views. I mean, already on the second tee box, old Tom treats us to quite a nice view of the greenskeeping shed, some farms. Rick's chunky six iron to the front of the green. Chunky draw. And a well struck iron shot. Gotta get up a little bit. <laughs> what yardage you got, Rick? 200. 200? The short 200, 190. Is he off the green? Yeah. Get down. Yeah. I don't know where mine is. Yeah. 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 God fucking damn it. Oh, nothing like having awful allergies and losing a good ball. 50 minutes on the ninth tee box. We're playing pretty good. Part three, uh, part 190. I could use a golf club. It's a very interesting golf course. Haven't played many quite like this. If you remember here and you told me this is an old Tom course, I would probably need proof. <laughs> Great strike. Thanks. It's got to sit also. Got a nicer bounce. Oh, that went straight through. <laughs> Didn't even hit the green? No, straight through. Sailed the green. Wow. Got someone on that hole. <laughs> We've got an intruder on our hole. All right, so we're about to make the turn here. And uh, my allergies are still definitely a factor. It's real tough out there. It's real tough out there. <laughs> I just can't stop sneezing. Oh, the allergies just really, you know. I'm just, you know, it's just my body, you know. I'm just, I gotta, I'm just thinking about going back there and, you know, I'm just gonna have to get surgery again, you know. Oh, that was such a great shot. If I was aiming for half the distance short of the hole. I haven't seen many situations like this on the golf course, have you? Where you're completely blind, only 10 yards away from the flag. <laughs> Rick has stated his opinion. <laughs> no, go on, go on. Oh my God. <laughs> Not even close. That felt pretty good. <laughs> you said you want me to hit it one-legged? Yes, please. What time is it? 56 minutes, 11.46. Oh, wow. So we could break sub two, no problem. Now that we know that, why don't we go to lunch and just take that time and double it. Whoa. Whoa. Time for lunch. I feel like we got the vibe of the course. I'm up Quick up. nine. I'm, I'm so hungry. Are we, just, are, we, are we cheating if we don't play 18? I don't know. Should we, is it okay if we don't play 18? What do you think about that? Do, how do you feel about it? You guys care? Couldn't care less. Why don't you do what you feel like? You're the one with the tiger shot on. True. I'm, I'm the tiger now. <laughs> that was class. Thanks so much. Enjoy the rest of your time. Too. Thanks, Rick. Um, and safe travels back. I'll see you on the second green Sunday, the Masters 2019. Love it. And then we'll have uh, more to talk about. Yeah. The TT Mountain Course, the most famous road racing circuit in the world. Certainly we start at the TT Grandstand, the tap on the shoulder, off they go, up through first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth gear, and then the plummet down Bray Hill, machine bottoms out at the bottom. Up down through to quarter bridge, the tight right hander. Be careful here because the tyres are cold and you're throwing it over onto the right hand side. Out then towards Braddon Bridge, the left right S bends of Braddon, and out through Snugborough 
and into Union Mills. Be careful on the first corner at Union Mills by the railway pub. Up through the, from the gooseneck, the climb, then going up through Joey's, the right-hander, and then up forwards towards Guthrie's in memory of a, a former TT rider, Jimmy Guthrie on the right, which gives you a beautiful view out over Scotland. Down through the nuke, the tri tricky nuke section, which isn't used for normal traffic, and then into Governor's Bridge, so named because the Governor's House is on the left-hand side as you negotiate the tricky, tricky hairpin and then out sweeping on to Glencrutchery Road under 17 minutes to complete a 37 and 3 quarter lap of the famous TT mountain course.